What's up, horror fam? Steven, aka Bojangles here. And come closer, my friends. I have something. <laughs> well, silly to show you because today we're going to be taking a look at some bloopers from the movie Valentine. So hold on to your butts, horror fam, and let's get this party started. Here we have Ruthie getting tossed through some shower glass and... Wait a minute! Did y'all see that? Let's take a closer look at this. Yep, just as I thought. This isn't a slasher flick. The glass actually shattered before she went through it! I know what's going on here. This house is haunted as f Oh, and another thing, shower glass is actually made with safety glass, so it wouldn't leave shards like that when it breaks. Gotta do your research, Aaron Harberts and Gretchen J. Berg. Okie dokie, so here we are with a slow shot while Kate is in the shower. Pay specific attention to this area right here. Alright, now she's out of the shower and suddenly... Ironing board. Wait the, what the, did y'all see that? A mysterious shadow on the iron that quickly tries to get the hell out of the shot? Now this definitely wouldn't be a crew member with a thumb up his ass. Nope, her apartment's haunted too. Run, bitch, run! Paige always ends up in a hot tub at these parties, and here we are. So, she's drifting away, probably dreaming of Danny Bonaducci like every other girl on the planet, when she suddenly startled! But wait a minute, where did this rose come from? It wasn't there in the previous shot. The killer would have had to place it there right in front of her. This definitely couldn't be a sloppy editing mistake. No way. This ghost just simply has a spectral heart on for Denise Richards. Whoops, sorry to scare the shit out of you. I just forgot my backpack. Uh, well, uh, good luck tomorrow. Yeah, thanks. You too. Thanks. And then I forget it again immediately. There's no backpack there. Five seconds later, what the hell did you do with the backpack? You know what? I'm sick of this bullshit. Let me get my backpack on and I'm out of here. <laughs> Aw, Adam surprises Kate with a nice lolly. So she hooks him up with an IOU, which we see like three times, but wait a minute. The numbers on the ticket here are different from when we see it here and different from when we see it here. You wipe that damn goofy smile off your face, David Boreanaz. This is just plain lazy. Okay, so Campbell's relighting the hot water heater, drops his matches, and they fall out like this. But suddenly, they're like this! Certainly not a continuity issue. They've just been mysteriously reformed into a satanic symbol by some sort of paranormal entity. Oh my word. Aww, and here we have Adam giving Kate a nice hug. But wait a minute, it goes from hugging to a shot of them sitting and then back to hugging again. This doesn't seem right. I mean, this certainly wasn't some lousy editing. No way. Not in Valentine. There's something more at work here. Let's go back to the beginning. Seems like we'll find our answers there. Okay. Adam goes in for a kiss on the left cheek, but then in the next cut, he's suddenly kissing the right cheek. Nope, definitely not a continuity error on behalf of the crew. Holy mackerel, I knew it! David Boreanaz, which clearly rhymes with David Paranomalianas. His character was a ghost the whole time. That settles it, horror fam. Valentine is definitely not a slasher flick. With this much going on, it's definitely a paranormal horror movie. Leave your comments below and let me know what you think. <laughs> Alright, and that's it for this video, horror fam. I was clearly just having some fun exposing some of the bloopers from the movie, and I hope you had fun too. 
I also hope you have an amazing Valentine's Day. Spend it with someone you love. I know I will. Alright, until next time, my friends. Look horror. Listen horror. Talk horror.